we um, talk to folks about jobs uh, within the Red Sox or within Fenway Sports Management at our uh, sister company or New England Sports Network, when you are interviewing uh, folks for, for jobs, uh, I think you can always tell if they play uh, team sports uh, or not. And it doesn't matter if you're the star uh, wide receiver or quarterback uh, or you were a, a role player uh, on the baseball team or the JV basketball player. Just being a part of a team uh, is really, really important because as you guys all move forward in life, whether you're playing in the NFL or uh, working in some other field, you're going to find that, that functioning as a part of a team, uh, as opposed to being an individual operator, is really going to serve you well. So we're really glad that you're here. Um, I grew up about a mile down the street, and I went to uh, a high school called Brookline High School. Uh, of course, our big rival was Newton North. Uh, so the Brookline High Newton North rivalry game was something that I always looked forward to as a little kid, and then as a student of Brookline High, um, would always go to those games. Never dreamed of the possibility of playing in that game, so I can only imagine what you guys are going through and what you're thinking. Uh, so when we when we started to do um, uh, more and different events here at Fenway, we we really wanted to try and open up the ballpark to the greater community, and so not just have uh, Notre Dame and Boston College come here, uh, but also have uh, some high school football and uh, some youth football. So when we've done outdoor ice hockey, uh, or when we've done international soccer, uh, even when we've done ski jumping and snowboarding events, we try to open up the park and, and have more uh, people participate uh, to really engage the, the greater Boston uh, and New England community. So that's why you're, you're here. Uh, it's gonna be a, hopefully an event uh, that you guys will remember for the rest of your lives. I, I think there have been um, people that participated in, in baseball or football uh, or other outdoor events here going back 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 years. Um, there were some Harvard football games here in the early days. The Patriots even played here uh, back in uh, before they moved to Foxborough. So I think the events that happen at Fenway are, are events that will stay with you for the rest of your lives. So, we really hope you enjoy uh, the, the experience uh, and anything that uh, our, our team and our staff here can do to make the experience more enjoyable, uh, please just, just let us know. Um, and then I, I just want to thank um, <clears throat> a couple folks internally with uh, Fenway Sports Management, uh, our partners in crime here putting these events together. Mark Lev is our uh, managing director uh, who really uh, oversees all of these events. He's very camera shy, and he was also not a football player, but a big soccer player at UVM, right? So that's Mark. I want to just thank you. For <laughs> you know, without Mark's leadership at Fenway Sports Management, none of this would uh, would be possible. Um, and so uh, we're, we're thankful for that. And the final thing I'll say uh, is a huge thank you uh, to the coaches. Uh, you guys, I'm sure you, you do this and you appreciate this. Uh, but please thank your coaches uh, for the opportunities that they've given you. Um, I, uh, I know there's, there's just nothing more important uh, than mentorship. And whether it's an English teacher, a math teacher, or a football coach, the sacrifices that your coaches make for you guys uh, are really incredible. Um, they're, they're doing this uh, all for you. It's not about them. It's about you and, and your development and growth. So thank your coaches. And, and on behalf of the Red Sox, uh, our ownership group, John Henry and Tom Werner, and everyone in our organization, uh, we thank the coaches for, for giving back and helping uh, these young men uh, have this great experience. So congratulations and uh, enjoy the event. And I guess uh, early happy Thanksgiving to everybody. So thank you. Good luck, guys. Enjoy it. Have fun, Jason. Nice to meet you. Sam, how are you? Good to see you. You guys excited? Yeah, how's the season going so far? Good. Good. Really good? Does that mean undefeated? Yeah, that's what I think. That's great. That's great. Awesome. Awesome. You guys seniors? Yeah. That's great. Well, I think every play here Championship game decades ago. Is it? Yeah. It actually lays out really well. Um, the original 
architects in the early 1900s yeah. built this place. They had uh, multi sport uh, use in the mine. And the sight lines were actually fantastic. The biggest thing we had to get over uh, when we did the DC you know, Nova Age experiment in 2014 or 15 was having the two teams on the same sidelines because we, we wanted to make sure that everyone in the seats could see. Um, and they're not looking over and it's football.